you with double shields. Sim and Junk are just gonna crush shields. Yep, they are. Oh, the TP. Oh, good. Oh, collect. <laughs> Whoops. I think that was a maybe a fire strike and a mine too. Although it didn't come up in the assist speed. Doha's caught out on the side. Doesn't matter. Halo and Jerry jump on in to the destruction, and that will be the Dallas Fuel wiping the Boston Uprising to start us off with. Sim junk rat. Your shield's just gonna melt. It doesn't matter. Oh, oh, oh Jerry's <laughs> right in front of me. Are you kidding me? Jerry didn't even see where he was coming from. Steps in the tire. Uh, in the trap, sorry, and then the tire <laughs> did the rest. <laughs> oh boy, that was uh, a sight to see. No one's coming through like the astronaut suit room, but the tire is. The window's there already. Oh, color hex. Managed to kill the tire before it actually did all of anything. Flux up in the skies, but the damage can't really be. Well, the damage is going to get mitigated completely by this wind, uh, the wall. And even the window coming out as well from uh, Crimzo to aid the damage. And he's already got 50% on another one. OT is here. Halo trying to get back to the point in time. Fortunately, not. There's an aggression die from Boston. The blade as well in the back. Mambong's already dead. Doha's taking out a whole bunch of damage. The reflect kill, though, from Color Hex. Killing two. Okay. Only God and Crimzo go down. This is very winnable. If you're the uprising right now, Gamsu's going to fall as well. No, he's on the point with an old button. Beautiful reflect kill again from Color Hex. That's three kills, and all three of them were reflects from the Genji. So, I don't kills. Let's have a look how that actually went down. Ooh. Oh, he was back through the. <laughs> it was already. Lead and grab here. Switching to Sombra of all things. Good shadow, one man, but it'll do. Gonna clean up Punk. Deflect somehow manages to uh, mitigate the swings of the hammer. I've never really understood that, to be honest with you, Hex, but. And it's just be like that, just be Genji things. But now the Dallas Fuel are going to control. Coming out first, Color Hex has to play. They're building time up on the point. Gams is going to step on to make sure it doesn't get instantly captured. There's the grab as well. And they're holding on to a lot of their ults. Very calm and collected are the Boston Knight Rising right now. But they need to go a couple of more as Punk and Youngmo have gone down. So is Jerry. Infusions just making sure Crimzo can't enter the fight. In fact, those Exo boots might be the death of him. Well, not quite. Fusion's going to go back over the bridge. <laughs> He's juggling him perfectly, in fact. Almost gets booped off the edge himself, though. As we know, that is going to be the question. All the turrets have been cleaned off, but now they're going to have to worry about Gamsu, who has an ult of his own. A flux and a shadow on the side. Jerry's kind of lost in the source on the point. The window's going to come out, too, and to mitigate a lot of that damage from Jerry. No, luckily, sucking a lot of that up, too, turning it into shields. Gamsu's going to swing his hammer once, find two kills, and another on Halo as well. And Dallas Fuel will claim Li Zhang 2-0. Put up this play too. They've got a lot of pressure on this point. In fact, they've almost got a tick, and that's going to force Uprising to at least put a little bit more bodies on the point. They do initiate the dive. Punk's on the low ground though with a Graviton Surge. He's going to wait and try and uh, stop Note from entering the point, but he's got a shield to do that. The Graviton Surge on the point is going to find one, and Bianco takes out Paintbrush to an extremely good start, but no still trading people out. And like you were saying before, Hex, this rather long, treacherous walk back from the attacker's spawn. It's almost exactly the same distance actually for the defense, so. The Dallas Fuel here, even if they pick off people, it's gonna trouble. 35 HP. He also activated shields as well at like the mid apex of the swing, so he got maximum shield usage around people. Nice little dive from Fusions though, onto the back line, only got a Crimson, end up going down. Here's the blade, can Doha salvage this fight? Punk's already dead and no gets isolated. Uprising with a resurrection as well onto Punk, was able to get that one off completely for free. Fuel, however, have claimed two ticks. Doha's going to stick on this. Gamsu's still behind. Minefield gets a lot of done. Oh, Gamsu also snipes Jerry out of the way. No power driver cooldown available, but he's going to chase it down Punk. No more res either as Jerry got res. And now Gamsu's just paying attention to the bat line, zoning two people away from the fight and killing Halo. Gamsu solo carrying this first point. Fusions falls. That should be the cap. That was. Uh, hello? Okay. Okay, yeah. I, thought, I thought Doha was just going to die, but no, luckily he received an object. Oh, no, no there you right. go. There you go. He, no, he did die in the end, and uh, Jerry also clicked Space Brush's head. Two shots, two kills. Thank you very much. Yeah, that'll be the fuel falling back now. No way they can win this fight. Hello. Minute remaining, though. This could be do or die time. Look at the ults from the fuel. They got the flux yeah. and they got the mines. Uh, Boston doesn't have a whole lot. You would love to get a flux on a couple of supports, maybe, and then drop the mines underneath them. Oh, gonna open up no, space this is it. No. Yeah. Is done. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> Flux with Bob. Everybody's a sitting duck high in the sky. That was an easy fight. There you go. The fuel cap second point. You've got two minutes. Back against the wall for the defenders. He can just push them into the respawn and swing away. Fusions is so low, man. Yeah, he got bashed there right at the end or stunned by uh, the rock, in fact. 
and he will go down rather easily. Punk's also going to fall. Color Hex with the blade to try and make something work. But, yep, yeah, Vanilla Blade doesn't do a whole bunch when you haven't got damage boost or the Transcendence to back it up. A blade for Doha to force everybody back into spawn. And that'll be the fuel capping the third point with 50 seconds remaining. I'll tell you that for sure. He just didn't die. Blade for Color Hex. Everybody's in that back corner there. He's looking to set up, but he's going to need a little bit more than just his blade. Transcendence is going to be committed as well. He gets pushed away, but saves the dash. Jerry's... Bob does end up falling down. No, Carl with 7 HP. Still getting work done. No falls, but is traded. However, the boss is not rising. All the meanwhile, we're able to set up on the point and claim two tough. ticks. Gamsu's going to come in, but he's going to have to run it into Punk, who used the Bob to pogo onto the high ground. Has the grab as well. Gamsu's going to try and chase him. Slams him into jam, and uh, now... The boss start rising, still have a chance. Even without Punk, Fusion starts his primal rage to bash away the supports, but with Myung Bong down, it looks uh, a little bit worse for them. Gamsu still causing havoc in the back line, now trying to focus down the DPS. Jerry not having the greatest time in the world. The Flux is going to lift them both up, and Crimzo is going to snipe them out of midair with another one added to the board as well as he kills off Fusions. Dallas Fuel looking stellar on this defense. And now Boston, they're only out. Oh, there's grabbing the high ground. Can they actually find the kill though? Only God has received the immortality field, and Doha's going to use the blade as well to punish the tanks who are very much in the front line. Beautiful bash, by the way, from uh, from Paintbrush, halting Fusion's mid jump, so he just falls and crashes back down to the earth and to his death. The Bob on the point was uh, to create a bit more space, but they're going to need a little bit more than that. They have the transcendence, but that's about it. Dallas Fuel are holding a very good position with Only God still alive. Punk ends up falling, and now the transcendence to keep Carl Hex alive and well in the fight, but he's killed through it. He's killed through the trance and he was 1% to blade as well. Oh, this looks just about over. The Dallas Fuel are going to full hold. However, it's going to be only God's job at this point to try and pressure point out and make everybody turn around. Jerry's on the high ground. He's in trouble. He's that coach gun to get away from Doha. He had Discord orb, orb on him as well, but that didn't stop him from killing Gamsu. See how much... Oh, that was a nice flick. You see how much... Uh, how many resources they're pumping into Jerry currently. There's um, Young Bong and uh, Halo throwing a lava back, so throwing the little heels and right click too. Just making sure he stays alive on the high ground. But good starts. And, uh, Jerry hasn't really got near a Bob, but at least they're building up. Painbrush has also gone pretty low. Pulse Bomb didn't really find all too much. As now Doha finds the engagement once more. Can they get the... Well, they can't get the rest because they're Mercy. What am I talking about? Painbrush is going to pull the wings. Going to damage boost this blade. Doha finds one in Punk. Goes for the reset. The rallying brick, though, is going <laughs> to... Just beat him around just a little bit. Now a returning blade from Color Hex. He's got the armor pack on him as well. The dash away from Doha. He's going to get Mega Pack before him as well. However, armor for Color Hex. So he should win out the, the duel. Yeah, it's in the big room at the top. Oh, Crimzo. Forces Transcendence. Forced to use the Transcendence. Mimbong is dead though. So that is a very good start for Fuel. They end up stabilizing. This is going to be... An extremely good look. Doha ends up going down as well, but Gamsu's got the Primal Rage ready to survive. But Paintbrush falls as well. Colorhex in the back. Low. Still doing damage. And Gamsu putting up so much ult charge as well. I mean, look at Colorhex. He does end up falling. Builds 55% towards another blade. Fusion's now making sure he can contest the backline just a little bit with the Primal Rage. Takes him out also. A minute remains for the fuel, but... Do have man advantage on the point also, with the spawns being so far away from the uprising. This should just be the cap for the fuel now. Yeah, Dallas just able to but it only takes one to win your fight. Notes are back on uh, Yo Faithful as well. That's a good start. You dive in, yeah, they die. That's, nice. that's uh, pretty decent. 64. Yeah, look at the Doha. Setting up the blade too. Gonna wait for that reset. Yeah, he has to, has to wait. For everybody to get the immortality field, you have to save your dash in that instance. Finds Punk as well. Jerry falls. This is a very good second point push as well. All resulted. All came off of those uh, first initial kills, right? Fusions and Color Hex going down. Color Hex has the blade and they have Rally also, but can they make anything work? Two ticks have been acquired for the fuel already. And uh, in fact, Halo is actually on the other side from his team. Only now is everybody kind of joining him. So half of them weren't even getting the armor to actually re-engage back onto the point. There's the blade from Color Hex, instantly stunned and killed off by Paintbrush. And that just gave them all the space in the world. They were hoping God almost has that bob, and Jerry's only at 50%. He's going pretty low too. Although Gamsu goes down first yet again. This happened well on their on their offense as well. A bit more punishing now as you're on defense. As now Boston not rising, take the space, but they allow the res. Oh man, that's not good. Although note does end up going down. Now they don't have res available. However, the bob is going to provide a lot of cover. 
coming into this point. And in fact, Halo stayed on the top of the high ground for way too long. He was actually burning alive. Plus, Bob was shooting, and then Doha finished him off with the dash. Nice come on to Only God, but Doha has still claimed two people and can, as long as he stays alive against Color Hex, which he's doing so quite easily, he's actually going to pull the blade. I mean, yeah, why not at this he point? Has to do it. I mean, Crimzo just went down, uh, Dallas had just lost two oh. people, they now lose Paint Barrage. That blade oh, that needed to get something done to equalize, and it does not. Yeah. Boston that should be able to grab this first point. <laughs> that was a sad, saddest blade ever. He got deflected against Color Hex. He has 300 HP with a whole lot of armor. Ain't gonna go down too quick. He's gonna find himself to the back line. Dashes into the pillar! Oh! Oh, checks! Oh, no, no! That's not the blade you were looking for, but that Graviton Surge definitely Ooh, was. Crap. Punk nails three in the grab. That's two ticks, maybe a third. In fact, only got tried to get back to the point, but no. Boss not rising. Cat with three minutes and 39 seconds in the time. Good DM there to make sure Crimson doesn't go down. You saw Jerry trying to tracking him. Speaking out, Crimson going down. There he is. He dead. Oh dear. Pokemon doesn't find too much from only got. There's the blade as well. Oh, Color Hex. Oh my god. <laughs> he instantly died. That would have refunded his ultimate if it was uh, a couple of years ago. My word, Jerry is going to put the bomb on the point to make Daz's fuel there. The life's a whole lot more difficult. And that will be the full hold from the Boston Uprising. As fuel could not find a single tick on the point. It was just stagger off. It's just one fight, like you said before, so you can just save ults, ideally, and then force out to force the defenders to use ults to stay alive. Good start onto Jerry, though. Now on the objective. Thank you, Winston, for calling that one out. That's a lot of damage onto Note. Someone saved Note. No one did in the end. Oh, the deflect was almost good. Almost killed only God, but uh, Doha was there to save him. And another, just a, a reset here. Yeah, go again. Charge a little bit of ult. And you're dead. Someone find him. There he is. Yeah, they're just intentionally kind of letting him live a little longer there. Any second he complete off the clock is important for them. They did plenty of ultimates of their own. Under a minute now, Joss. This is almost too perfect. Bob's going to come out as well. Metallic Field already used, but Doha's going to fall. Color Hex now with the blade. There's the grab. That's a whole lot of damage. Gamsu surviving through it, but not for long. Oh, the cleanup was too easy. 17 people hitting Q at the same time, and they find the 33%, and there you go. So that would have been... Uh, he was playing with fire there just a little bit, but uh, he was okay. Only got gets jumped on yet again, but you can see the energy for Crimzo just draining all so low, trying to keep everybody alive. Now Halo pops the wings. Hayburst does end up falling too, so this is the kind of slow, methodical push. Yeah, Dynamite's are going to do a whole bunch of damage as well. I mean, as soon as Crimzo is out of the right click, or the left click, sorry. He's going to die tomorrow, right click. Okay, you're good. Crimzo's going to use the coal though to uh, swing the momentum in their favor. Colorhex was caught in at the back line, and hey, look at that. Yeah, back is... all the way to spawn yet again. <laughs> Uprising. Yeah, no, I, I think you uh, pull back here just to... For the fuel, they also have the blade, but Punk's got the grab. You really just want to grab blade at this point, I think. Or you just do that. Um, or you just kill Doha before he can even get it off, actually. Uh, Jerry now on the payload. Nice couple of headshots. That's an easy cleanup with the help of the Bob. Oh, there is going to be an engagement transcendence as he crashes to the ground. Not quite needed as he was. A lot of that was bubbled. But the play for Doha is going to be good. Transcendence runs out. He does deflect a couple of the shots. Oh, he's going to get dueled out. Yes, he is. In fact, a Halo came in with the melee to finish him off. A resurrection, too. This is what I was talking about. The tempo's in their favor now as Color Hex also has the blade. There's no way you're going to be able to survive that one, Paintbrush, unfortunately. He does manage to get away, but not for long. Only God and him fall to the. Got the bomb, like you said. Oh, yeah, Jerry just... You see how desperate he wants high ground right now. Yeah, it's a bit of an awkward angle shooting from here. But uh, with notes going down and Doha jumping into the back line to try and find a kill, this should be all over. Yeah, especially with the bomb coming out. There's no way you survive that if you're Gamsu. And here's the pressure that, the, uh, that you were talking about, Hex. And they do have the grab as well. So very early. I want to see them early hold. Like, really bad. He's fine. He's just found his way. There's the crab. Okay, this is actually a perfect position. Yeah, isolating Gamsu there on the wrong side of the wall, so we can't receive any healing. Goodbye, paintbrush. Goodbye, note. And goodbye, second point. That will be the fuel. Yeah, just inting onto it now to make sure they can burn a little bit more time. Oh, there's the cold. There's the blade, though. Perfect time to use it too. Discord orb. Easy kill. And a cleanup as well. Maybe. Yeah, there's no way he's not going to fall. That should just be it. Halo falling in the front line is uh, disastrous. As Memo doesn't have much HPS. But does have the win condition of a grab. Uh, they can shatter before it comes out. 
Yeah, I think I only caught one, but it's, it's still a kill at the end of the day. You have to back off right now. Yeah, even the coalescers just to make sure the fight is 100% done. You still have a lot of ults to rely on too. I don't actually mind that coal usage whatsoever. It just makes the fight way quicker. Yeah, I actually don't even mind that jump. Fusion just racketing of everybody's brains. Like, it's kind of hard to really deal with fusions right now. And he has earned a Primal Rage already again, but Pyongyang does end up falling. However, they do have Primal Rage and Blade. If they keep Color Hex alive, this could be a win. Remember, falling with Transcendence could be disastrous, but he's really just trying to save onto it until Doha pulls the blade. Fusion just created the space as Boss not rising near the third point. But can Dallas get back in time? They got the ults to work with two, but Color Crimson goes down 20% away from the coal as well. Color Hex pulls the blade. One dash, two kills. Third point capped for the uprising, and they off on the point. He's good. Color Hex dead. Jerry alive. Keep Jerry alive. Double pocket on Jerry so he can click some heads. Oh, please, get him away from Gamsu. Gamsu, all he needs to do is just disrupt Jerry to stop him from shooting the back line. That's literally it. And Punk falling as well. Yeah, no, it's fine. Gamsu is more than okay. Like, he gets out, it's all good because Jerry's been distracted for a, a, a good two minutes there, almost, it feels. And now only got with a Bob, takes out Halo, who used the Valkyrie as well. But you have to look out for where Myungbong is. He negates both of those ultimates. And yeah, they found him. You can see Gamsu now just trying to play dodgeball with the uh, Halo. And he does manage to do so. What was that? There were three people looking at Halo. But the HPS, I mentioned before, is just so low. Don't solo EMP him. Surely not. No disrespect. No, he's good. He's just going to... Well, the Transcendence offensively went in. Got absolutely nothing. But it did force out some ultimates from the other side of things. The next couple of kills are going to be critical. And they all go Boston's way. <laughs> Only God just dies in the back, no HP. Yeah, it looks like they lost that actually where Color Hex was in that engagement. Got a nice reflect kill as well. So we need to stop, uh, stop this abuse of Zen. <laughs> it's sad. It's just like it makes you're just wasting sad. everyone's time waiting for that last 50 HP. Come on. Color Hex pretty sad right now. He's hacked on 2 HP. Yeah, that's going to be an easy cleanup. That Graviton Surge was uh, looked pretty good, but it almost had to feel around the corner. No one could actually touch it. So the rest is uprising. Kind of just left out to dry. Grab, good. Got to follow up. That was a nice coach gun shot to stop uh, Gamsu doing really all of anything. Those mines, yeah, they're going to do nothing. There's the Graviton Surge on the window. You want to shoot through it, sure thing. But everybody just jumps into it to make sure the supports stay alive. Uh, quite literal body blocking. Kalhex still has the blade, but he gets squished by Gamsu. But they now have the the... EMP. I mean, that's the only real tool they've got left, but it yeah, shouldn't really no matter. Bugs. Color Hex is going to be able to get out, but he's going to get instantly EMP'd if not hacked. Transcendence comes through. Doha with the EMP. There's the blade. Halo dies. EMP comes out, and the rest is history. That's the true flow chart right there. Myungbong defaulting Myungbong and Halo, and it forces the enemy team to. There you go. He's going straight to the back already. Color Hex didn't receive any protection, and now he is dead. Now can't even build up ults. Gamsu high in the skies once more. Oh, the body block wasn't quite good enough. Punk attempting to at least try and stop those bullets from landing on Jerry, but Gamsu did him dirty once again. At least the res is there, but that's not again up for another little while at least. Oh, oh, Color Hex oh, oh. trying to get stuff done. Had to touch the payload. But yeah, instant hack, instant kill. That will be the hold, I can imagine. Nice double shot there from Only God. Just before the second, uh, the first corner, even they're going to hold them 40 meters. Yeah, now they're doing whatever forward. he wants. Yeah, and uh, this is going to be it. Just pushing people away. However, oh, he's low. Yep, yeah, there you go. He already used the the shielding there, so yeah, he was going to yeah. go down rather fast. You reset with Doha dead too. You might be able to build an EMP, but I'm not entirely sure. That is a headshot and a half by Only God. Oh my God, is not expecting that. It's been more than once that Oni God has hit that particular shot on Color Hex. Uh, in the last like three or four minutes, he's hit a couple of Fusions them. is alone. On point. Don't see nine. Oh my word. Point. Okay, I'm done. Yep. I'm done.